these drummers are beating for a change. Rad Rhythms is a political, anti-capitalist, anti-sexist, anti-racist, um, anti-oppression drumming group, and we play at political events. On Saturday, Rad Rhythms joined a crowd of dozens to protest the sixth annual Halifax International Security Forum. We oppose the Halifax Security Forum just as we oppose war, um, as we oppose Harper and Conservatives spending um, the money that should be going to Canadians and poor in Canada on killing innocent civilians overseas. Um, and I think we see all these things as connected. The protest was held outside the Weston Hotel in an area known as Cornwallis Park. But on Saturday, it was referred to by a different name, Halifax Peace and Freedom Park. Before the protest began, protesters covered a statue of Edward Cornwallis, the controversial founder of Halifax. Isaac Sani is an organizer of No Harbor for War, one of the groups behind the protest. No Harbor for War has a connotation of the ha Halifax Harbor, not being a base for war, war against other peoples, but also it's a broad metaphor as well, that no war should be given harbor in Canada. Canada should be a genuine factor for peace. Sani says Canadians should feel comfortable speaking out against the war. People feel disempowered. Um, there is this massive disinformation uh, and a complete distortion of what's unfolding in the Middle East and Ukraine and elsewhere. Police stood guard in front of the Weston and watched the protest from afar, but it remained peaceful. Demonstrations like this aren't going to, to fundamentally change anything, but they're a spot that we can jump off from in terms of, you know, transforming our everyday lives um, and the everyday functioning of the system that, that creates these things. For their part, organizers of the security forum say their vision is one of a more peaceful, cooperative and secure world, and that the event was a success. Alan April, WTV News, Halifax.